Oh, we're doing good so far, I guess. That one I don't think I can reach right now. Uh, I'm not really sure how to grab that one. That one I might have to look at, figure out. Unless the sponge hook works. There's another, like, hook down with SpongeBob to get it. It looks like one with his, from the other. Yeah, we'll figure it out. Now, I need to get back to Mr. Krabs. The fake Mr. Krabs. Chip me away. Ah. Uh. Here is your reward. Thank you, Mr. Krabs. I always wanted one of these golden back scratchers. Number 28. So was a thing right there. Oh, it's a clam. I did it. So spongy. All right, we got all but the thing. Good. We're only, the only thing really left here are socks, but if I don't, I'm not trying to 100% it, so I'm not too worried if I don't get uh, all of them. Ow. Ouch, ouch. Like a spring I feel great. Why is this on the track? Missed. I love opening presents. Too pretty. Can't take it. They blow up and they hurt. Oh, uh, that's a long tongue out. Ugh. There we go. All right. Now we can go and connect the towers, and we've gotten all the spatulas in this one, at least. At least uh, that part. I'm still lacking in the sock department, but again, not too heavily worried about that unless I'm, like, desperate for uh, spatulas to beat the game. I don't know what the recommender or what you need to have to win, but either way. Let's go. Oh. Never see it again. God, the bus runs out here. Eh. Ah, surfs up. Now give me my sunscreen back. Congratulations, I'm here. Bob. You're king of the beach. Here, have a golden spatula. Thank you. I did it. That's number 30. All right, and that takes care of all of this area, so now we can leave. Eat. I feel like a new sponge.
sticky like a new sponge, yeah, yeah. Last way to do it. Yeah, I can just travel. Back to Bikini Bottom. Your treasure chest's looking a bit light, boy. 4,500, that's what you wanted. I only have 2,000. Wow, SpongeBob, you found some. Now they're back home, safe where they belong. Here's your golden back scratcher. Spatula. I don't speak Italian. Damn it, he got me there every time. <laughs> 31. <laughs> Gets me every time with it. All right, well, it looks like now our next area is this direction. Next up, we'll be heading to the side dome. I have brought you to here to face a great challenge. Well, I just... I've got nerves of steel and muscles of sand. Damn right. And eyes of jelly. My Poseidon has been bleached by a mighty foe whom you must vanquish. Bring it on, your highness. Bring it on. In this corner, defending the Poseidon. So quiet. Hold on. It's going to be muted suddenly. And his challenger. A huge oh, God. Shaped like a squirrel. Look, it's a giraffe. <laughs> Uh oh. Fresh like a spring breeze. SpongeBob has an opening, but will he get the drop on the robot? Oh, I have to hit that one spot and I fucked up. Great there we go. Barrier reef. Take that, bitch. The robot's taking a beating out there. I love the fish popping in every time to talk. No matter what I play. An opening, but will he get the drop on the robot? I did. I'm always in a fucking ring fighting someone. I wanna play, I wanna play. Can't think we're not playing. We're fighting for our lives. I wanna play, I wanna <laughs> play. That's just how I move. Bounce and throw the head. Yay, I get to play. Spring, the old clothesline move. Ah, uh, DK's favorite maneuver, the clothesline. The robot's losing its head. What a shocking takedown by Patrick. I get it. Patrick's Whoa. just getting too Please close whistle. to that metal monster. Got my ass spanked. Ooh, yep. The robot's hey, losing his face. head. Oh, Take nice that, flying you uh, bitch. head thing move by Patrick. The elbow missed. Off the ropes. The bounce. Looks like Patrick oh, has a big delay. opportunity here. Wow, I've never seen such an electrifying oh, match. Your turn, SpongeBob. Oh, ah, uh, we. <laughs> Yay! Bounce and bash the head. The old clothesline move. Ow. Oh, what an Aha. Who do you can? I feel like a new sponge. Ow. Ow, that still hits me, even though I wasn't touching. Fresh like a spring breeze. Piece of shit. 
That's a bubble bash opportunity if ever I've seen one. You're nice getting all of it. SpongeBob. This match is just about over. Off the ropes. Defeated. What an upset here at the Poseidon! Well, <laughs> that was quite a battle. Tell him what he's won, Johnny. It's a new power, the Bubble Bowl. But wait, there's oh. more. A golden spatula. And that's not all. A gift certificate for $5.32 to Dean's Little Shop of Dried Fish Flakes. Yeah, that's all I wanted. Oh, thank you. It all means so much. I... I promised myself I wouldn't cry. Cry all you want, but not here. We just wax the floors. Okay. Makes sense. How, I was say, how long do we got to look at you? Hey, Plankton. Yes, what is it? I was just wondering why all the robots seem to be coming from inside the chum bucket. Have they? I really haven't noticed. Uh, yeah. And then there's that big flashing neon sign that says, Robot Headquarters. SpongeBob, I'm your friend, right? No, not really. <laughs> exactly. And as your non-friend, I worry about you. Like right now, you're thinking too much. I'm worried you might really hurt yourself. Tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to think for you. This way, you won't hurt yourself. And you can just keep working on getting me into the chum bucket. Thanks, Plankton. You're the best non-friend a friend could have. No more thinking for me. Seems about right. I think I understand. Now I have the bubble ball. Oh, God. Now we're over here. I go right to this location in it. Just because I only re recently remember this one, so I'm like, I might as well come back and see. The other one I think was at, uh, Somewhere maybe at the this is Puff's like driving place, but I don't remember. Either that or I think it might have been Jellyfish Fields actually. I got a bubble. Oh, there it is. Dangerous. Forty. Do I need to get like right in the hundred or whatever the middle one? using this power. Oh, maybe in the corner ones, because that's usually the hardest. I don't know if I'm doing it right because it just says I needed to play and I'm not even sure if I'm playing it. 
I want to get it in the hole. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. <sighs> There's nothing like the smell of bubbles in the morning. It smells like victory. And bubbles. Soap. That was a 50. I don't know if I need to get it all in them. Okay, well now there's plenty to look around in here as I'm a ball. Let me teach you how to bowl a bubble. Maybe I had to Press do that. this button and you'll <laughs> bowl a bubble that can knock down robots from a safe distance. Wow! Remember though, the bubble bowl only works on things that are close to the ground. Got it. Thank you. Maybe that's what I needed to do and now I can access the thing, but either way... I now know. Oh, my golden underwear. Flash, sponge wearing More health. Of underwear coming through. I More feel health. Like a new sponge. Yay. Forty. Hey, forty for over there. I only got thirty-two. Oh, there was more. Okay. I wasn't looking. I got distracted because I saw a spatula. Bolo Rama. Damn you, cubes. Oh, this one. That way. Uh. Oh, I was there and just fucking limp dick the jump. There's my spatula. I get to visit uh, Mermaid Man and them and it's not really the real Mermaid Man. Wow! Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy! My heroes! Hit me with the water ball! Hit me, hit me, hit me! Eh, we don't do that stuff anymore, kid. We're retired. Is that the TV repair man? <laughs> no, it's that excited sponge kid again. Oh! Uh, are you sure he can't fix the TV? Mermaid Man, twould be my greatest honor to fix your television. Good be! Whoever is coming through my screen, leave. Hey, Sponge Kid, <laughs> you really want to help out? Oh, boy, would I? Okay, then. Uh, but lighten up a bit on the enthusiasm, huh? Uh, you're making my bowels act up. Uh, we've got a little problem with some robots down in the Mermelair. Are you sure you're up to this task? Absolutely, Barnacle Boy. Well, go over to the couch to access the Mermelair. We'll meet you down there. Is it pudding night yet? <laughs> This is a Bikini Bottom news update. We're getting unconfirmed reports that the robot menace is emanating from the chum bucket. The proprietor, Plankton, has released the following statement. 
Hear me now! I'll crush you all beneath my... And now back to your regular programming, <laughs> Retirement Home Girls Gone Wild! Oh, God. I love opening presents. Looks like I want to watch that show. I like how it's enter the merm lair, hold B to skip. A, a, yes, no. Ah. Okay, there's a whole other place. Looks like we're in. Ow. <laughs> it's a it's an all right attempt, but it's still not the same. Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy. You shouldn't sneak up on Mermaid Man like that. His heart's not so good. Come to think of it, nothing on him is that good anymore. Sorry, Mermaid Man. It's just that I'm always so excited to see you two. Standing in your awesome presence gives me the chills of justice. See? I've got goosebumps on my goosebumps on my goosebumps on my goosebumps. All right, kid. Knock it off. Just tell us what you want. Well, I really want a new pair of sunglasses. Patrick sat on my old ones. That's not what I meant. <sighs> Actually, it's a good thing you showed up, young sponge of good... It is? It is? Yes, a bunch of it evil is? robots have taken over the Mermelair security system. It's up to you to shut it down and stop them. Well, why him? We're perfectly capable superheroes. Because it's Thursday and we have a whole bunch of doctor's appointments. Ah, fish sticks. I forgot. Go talk to huh. the Mermelair computer in the next room. She'll tell you what to do. I accept this awesome responsibility, Mermaid Man. You won't be disappointed. Shamed, maybe, but not disappointed. Fuck was that that just came out? It looked like my tie. To the doctor's office! Away! Losing his shit. It's not just any fun. Don't step on the red squares of the disco floor. Fresh like a spring breeze. <sighs> There's nothing like the smell of bubbles in the morning. Smells like victory. They're gonna blow up and hurt me, isn't it? Don't touch them or the energy beams. Yeah, I kind of figured it. We shouldn't touch. What the fuck? Oh my god, is that a sponge? Oh, that seems dangerous. That seems equally as dangerous. That means he won't attack a starfish. That robot is named Arf. Use the bubble bowl to defeat him. Sure that that's what I should do, because he just keeps launching fucking shit at me. Better off smacking him with his own fucking guy. Why am I running like this? Ow. I just smack you. How would I just do that? That, that seems easier than me trying to use the bowl. hook out there. Uh. Ready for another fantastic day! Oh, you have to be on the hook. 
usually how it goes for all of them, but it would have been nice. Oh, I know where a sock is and a hook. You use the bowl, we'll turn the power wheels bowl on one side of it to make it turn. for the sock. Another find for Patrick. over here. Yeah, 34. Neat. Still a whole other portion over there I feel like I gotta go look at, though. I think. Oh, no, that's where I came from. Yeah, that's the dance floor. It came over there. Yeah, so that makes sense. All right. Got a sock and a spatula. There's like another side objective to hit buttons or something, but I, I don't know it what it is yet. The main chamber. The Mermelair, secret fortress of the wrinkly superheroes Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy. The fuck's he always on the? I thought you guys had doctor's appointments. What are you doing here? Squidward, am I happy to see you? And not just the kind of happy you feel in the front of your knees, but the kind of happy you feel in the back of your elbow. Oh, you'll never believe what's been happening. Yeah, yeah, I've already been briefed by the geriatric duo. Those two old coots sent me in to get updated with the Mermelair computer. But since you're here now, I'll let you do it. It's right over there. Oh, look at this place. I mean, police. Would it kill them to lay down a few throw rugs? And all this wasted space? How did those two old fogies make all this? Oh, that's easy. In episode 27, the Mermelair is invaded by the digging monsters of Bermuda, and then- Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. Not need to know. Patrick thing there. Solo Rama. We. Suspicious. I'll live here now. looks safe. Just looks like something they traverse all the time. All my money keeps going. Actually, it's a Patrick Teeter-Totter. Don't know what... The, oh, this. You're my hero. Hey! You're yellow. When did that happen? <laughs> uh, I don't know, sir. I really don't know. It all started in 95. I've got a job for somebody who can throw things. Leave it to us. I'm great at throwing things. All you have to do is pick up a throw fruit and throw it into each of those funnel machines. Throw, throw the... No, throw the throw fruit. Throw the tilty. You might want to be quick about it. I tend to explode. What? I mean, oh. they tend to explode. Yeah, I noticed. You sure gotta carry a lot of stuff around. 
Where does this take me? I know you. You're that guy. Hmm. I've been looking at him. A lot more power to activate the hydroacoustic Doppler module. You think you can handle this? I could see Squidward's house from up here. And he's not wearing any pants. Oh. Oh, wait, he never wears pants. Now listen up. There are eight cylinders over there. If you throw something at the cylinders, it'll turn around to the power side. Turn all eight cylinders around to the power side, and I'll give you a reward. Sorry, what was that? I was watching Squidward. Just start turning those cylinders. Okay, I mean, I'm not even done with what was down there. I sort of just showed up. Boy, how do I get back down? one of those things I need to hit. Oh, God. Oh, I hate these puzzles. It's not even that hard, it's just I'm gonna be dumb. So dumb with these. Uh, da, da, da. This. You have this as a system here. Why? Do, why do you work with this? Also, that you have to constantly use a fruit to do it. I did it. Didn't even pay attention. Hey, buddy, I did it. Ah, uh, well done. Now there's enough power. What do you need all that power for? Why, my foot bath, of course. Here, have a golden spatula. Hey, who am I to judge? Be the way. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, That's boy. 35. Ow. So shiny. Oh, there's a sock up there. This one goes boom. Woo! Up we go. Oh, overthrew it. God, this is terrible. Coming back. That's much better. There we go. Oh, really? How? Oh god. Oh god. Got it. Get out of here. Why is this a system you guys have set up? What is this hell? Oh god. Uh, uh.
<laughs> now I can get some sleep. <laughs> you did it. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. That's 36. Oh, man. What a crazy place you guys live in. What the fuck? And then I missed one because it's at the top of the computer. I didn't get that, but we are grabbing some extras. Things that we didn't have to do, but of course we're gonna do it. We. Missed the sock. Take me a couple tries. Ah, try again. Oh, that sucked, but it worked. Alright, now we can switch back. It is I, SpongeBob! Just absolutely rude. You've just met the Sponginator. It shines! Fresh like a spring breeze. Button. Wall looks like it's supposed to like come out so I can do that. I guess I gotta wait. A little ahead of myself. I love opening presents. wall was activated. That looks like a delicious pair like of underwear. Ow, I lost it instantly. Up I go, up I go, I'm a sponge and I'm ready to go. That wall's been activated. Ow, every fucking time. Jesus. I like to think this is how Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy get around when they're on this thing. They don't ride it normally. Fresh like a spring breeze. They like to just use their tongue. Not a sentence I really want to say. Gross. Seven. We got it. In order for me to regain control of the security system, you need to press all the override buttons spread throughout the Mermelair. The first one is here. Press the buttons. Got it. <laughs> when you have pressed them all, what I imagine you Shadow sounds like. Here to press the master shutdown button, you will be rewarded. Return here. Got it. Are you listening to me? Listening. Got it! I've hit, what, two of the buttons so far? Throughout the Mermelair. I don't know if it means just here, or... Uh, the other locations, but we'll keep an eye out. Press the master shutdown button to lower the bridge. Oh. 
it's usually spread out pretty well, I would think. Double check real quick. Very good, so they do go into the other areas. I wanted to worry about that. I'm not just running around the same, like, four areas being like, I don't see a button. It's like Miss Puffle with the kids Larry, was all in one. Oh, hey, Gary. Made your way down to the deepest recesses of the Mermelair. Meow. Oh, you took the elevator. Oh, how do I get to the top of this room? Meow. You're right. I bet those tunnels will take me up to the top. Good thinking, Gary. God for Gary to help us. Disco floor. I feel like a new sponge. Why they have a dangerous disco floor. And who wouldn't want a dangerous disco floor, I guess? Fresh like a spring breeze. Dare shoot that tartar sauce at me. I feel like a new sponge. That's even what you're calling it. I love a Freak. presence. How scared I look. Ow, oh, fuck. Like a spring breeze. A lot of things trying to shoot me right now, and I just want to get through. I feel like a new sponge. I took care of him. I don't have enough. Thousand two nine hundred. That needs enough resources. Two thousand three hundred. All right, yeah, I'm end short. Duh. I can't count. But bachelor though, thirty-eight. I can get enough if I go beat up the guys I just ran away from. Beat up the guys I was trying to run by in that shit shit that shit fest, I'd be okay. Take the upper path. This go. Takes me to the rolling ball area, which is where I think the last button is. Upper. Why not? I've been using all of my money anyway on this shit, and I'm never gonna have enough to give any to Mr. Krabs. overpay for a spatula. Ow. Hey, you. Patrick needs to do laundry. I missed entirely on that jump. Fuck. And for the box. Alright, well. Kind of an expensive sock. You know, what can you do? So is Mr. Krabs's...
expensive pay on things. I don't even know why he's in here. Why I did that. I'm just doing things for the sake of doing things. Look, boy! There's gold under that glass! Gold, I say! My eyes are getting sweaty just- All you have to do is get that great big ball into that there cup. How do I get the ball rolling, Mr. Krabs? You start the process by bubble bowling up this ramp to hit that button. Good luck, SpongeBob. Ah, uh, shit. Number one on the Bikini Bottom scavenger hunt. Three years running. Uh, thank you. Successful. Bolo Rama. Somehow I don't think he needs a hand. Ow! Not. That was uh, stressful, but I did it. <laughs> and a sock. That was just me winging it all in one go. I got the sock. First try. Got the golden spatula. So impressed with me. Even DK will be like, look at all that gold. Hell, that guy from Austin Powers will love all this gold. Amber. Came from, right? Okay. Go here. Back. I have regained control of the security system. Here is the reward I promised you. You have pressed all the security buttons. Now press the master shutdown button. All right, we just grab number 40. Put him out of this. Grab it, spatulas. That said, enter the Apparently evil the containment wave. Been shut down, and we got a good checkup. Hooray for justice in all its multi-splendor glory! Yeah, well, Justice Boy, you also cut the power to the Mermelayer's VCS. That's Villain Containment System. Is that bad? Does Mermaid Man smell like sour milk? Yes! Yes, I do! <laughs> Damn right. Oh, no. It looks like one of the villains is broken free. What's that? An evil doer on the loose? <laughs> really wish oh, it was it? the him. Man Ray! The atomic oh, flounder! Oh. The dirty bubble! No, worse than that. He's your arch enemy. Prawn! 
<laughs> Did someone call? Oh, I thought maybe I was looking at superheroes. But now I see it's just a couple of pieces of gnarled driftwood. <laughs> Run! I'll never forgive you, you madman! What did Kron do? The worst thing you can imagine. He put all of Mermaid Man's white clothes in the washer with a red sock. You Everything son of a bitch. Turned pink. <laughs> pink! How horrible! Personally, I thought pink made you very pretty. Really? Sure, pretty stupid. Damn it. <laughs> Got his ass. Yikes. What is that yellow thing? Some kind of mold? I'm not mold, I'm a sponge. There's a cellular difference. A cellular difference! Yeah, yeah. Thanks for the lesson, Dr. Science. See you later, Pinky. The hell? By the seven seas, Kron. I shall not rest until you are captured. But first, I shall have to change from my secret identity into Mermaid Man. You don't have a secret identity, you old coot. Maybe you better take care of Prawn while I take care of this. I <laughs> shall avenge you, oh, Mermaid Man. I have this covered, I guess. Oh, that is awful. Oh, God. When does it end? When does it end? Oh, I have the bowl. I have the bowl, of course. It's the new mechanic. You just met the Sponginator. Fresh like a spring breeze. Hammer. Bye, get it. Bitch. Sponges of new do I need to feel? Ow, I can't hit this fucker. Why? Oh, that lost a lot of health. Batter up. Wait, no. Frank. Here, I found this in my sock drawer, next to a bunch of pink socks. It's another golden spatula. Thank you, Mermaid Man. I shall always live my life by your shining example. Let goodness and kindness... <laughs> Are you still here? Go. Just leave. 41. I just... Go away! Don't call anymore! Got all the socks? We did everything in this. Very nice! Please don't call! Ever! Oh. We could just run back, but I mean, it's just faster to just teleport out. We have everything here, so. Back to Bikini Bottom! Twenty-five to go into that place. Forty, we can now go into there, but we'll go to the lower one. I mean, I always go low to high, even though I feel like if I went to the higher one, they'll give me the power I'm looking for too, like the next ability and stuff, and I could use it in whatever those areas I'm going to. But that's fine. Most of the extra shit is for socks, it seems, and I'm not going too crazy with that. I love opening presents. There's still some stuff here to find. In these tree house, of course. Something to do with the ball, too, I could do. To the police station. Rock bottom, help force, chum buck, a flying Dutchman. I don't see that being them. There might be smaller locations compared to what I just did. 
But that'll be it for SpongeBob. We got a nice two hours uh, session in. We got to uh, got some progress made. We're now at uh, 41 of these things, so we're doing good. Next time, we'll uh, we'll be jumping into the number 20 area, which is uh, rock bottom. But before that, we'll of course look at Sandy's home and the police station and uh, make sure there's nothing I want or need there. But lots to do still as we make our way through our SpongeBob fun times. <laughs>